Welcome back to Combat Time, and uh, we are still sticking around with Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Uh, really wish they could have gotten that, uh, you know, Bruce Willis and Ben Affleck DLC in there, but, um, you know, I, I don't think Ed Boon was able to sign that contract. We are going to go deep into the lore of Mortal Kombat. Some of the worst lore ever, because... It's all going to be about Taven and Dagon, the absolute bottom of the barrel. I'm saying it, folks. You think Su Hao? You think Draman? You think Mocap? No. Taven and Dagon are the worst. As bold, bold statements I'm making, but it's true. It's damn true, and I don't care who knows it. I need to talk to Kenny about this shit. He has to agree with me, I think. Is so bad. Anyway, uh, Conquest Mode in Armageddon, for those that don't know, um, it's quite a bit different from the last Conquest Mode. It is done. Taven and Dagon have been hidden. The dragons, or an <laughs> I look at this I check. Safe in the caves. I only hope Shao Kahn shows no interest. Do you bump in into a lot of shit, ma'am? It is unlikely. His attention seems focused only on Adenia. The pyramid is completed. You are certain the battle will take place here, Delia? I am. I have sent Blaze to monitor the realms. When you the have sent comes, Method Men! The dragons and the quest will begin. From Def Jam? No. Uh, this is King Jared, so this is like the previous ruler of Adenia that Shao Kahn jacked up. The corruption of a mortal combat. And uh, this is like stuff way, way, way in the past. And it's another thing that leads up to the events of Armageddon, much like uh, Shujinko. But Shujinko is just kind of shat on in this. No one really, you meet him very briefly, but he's kind of like jobbed out. For the Elder Gods, they will bring honor to Adenia. And to you, if they survive. We have equipped them well. And the monoliths will hone their skills. This These look like done. the kind of character designs you'd see in like a French CG fantasy cartoon. You know what I'm saying? Mark on a quest to save the realms from Armageddon. May the elder gods watch over them. All right, so whoa, we we let's seal our sons inside these. Hey there. It is good to see you have awakened. <laughs> Do not worry, your strength will soon return. Orin. What These dragons are so fucking lame. To protect you from harm until I receive the signal to awaken you. Like that's the best you dragon voice you could have gotten. You, you couldn't got Benadryl Cumberbun. Why am I in Earth Realm? Your father has a very important task here for you. Your brother Dagon. I'll never press A. You can't skip any of these terrible cutscenes. From what I understand. What? Competition. Last I remember, Dagon and I were summoned to father's throne. Yes, and then your father knocked you out, drugged you, and put you into these stone sarcophaguses. I was charged only with hiding you. I don't know the details of your quest. Thanks. No. This is all. Look at fucking Taven. He's like rando creation number five on the character creator. Find the main chamber and place your hand on the altar. Dagon looks a little bit better, but holy shit, could you not have picked Dagon as his name? No doubt your brother has been awakened by Carl and will be sent there shortly. Why will I need a weapon? Alright, so it's a competition, but, uh, you know, your brother gets uh, a leg up on you. Okay. Just go into my swirling asshole portal. It's weird. So, uh, you know, again, if you don't know, now you know. Uh, Conquest Mode is much less of an RPG adventure tutorial, and it's more of an action game, which is okay. It's just not a great action game. Now, I want to talk about this in one second and see if we have a cutscene here. I don't think we do. Um, you know, I'm playing this on my 360 right now. It looks quite nice. It looks okay. Visually, all things considered, it looks better than Conquest Mode from uh, Deception. Now, I remember very, very uh, vividly that, like, maybe in an interview or some type of, uh, you know, news article, that they were getting the team uh, at Midway San Diego or Paradox Entertainment, I forget what their name was, that made Mortal Kombat, um, found the map, nice. Uh, not really. The maps are ugly. lead me to my father's temple. Huh, I hope I don't get lost all along the way. 
It's literally impossible to get lost. Um, that they were going to be making this mode uh, for the MK team. Is that true? I honestly don't think it is because this plays way, way worse than uh, Shaolin Monks. So I don't know, but like I really don't feel it. They, that's actually what happened. Maybe that was the initial idea. Oh, I wanted to, to kill all these uh, arachnoids, but uh, I, I can, I guess. So I, I was just like, oh yeah, that's such an awesome idea. Like a whole other team to make this mode. And then that frees up the MK, like, you know, it frees up NetherRealm Studios. I mean, they were just midway back then. This is Cobra's legendary glove, by the way. Yeah. There's 60, like, relics of Mortal Kombat characters, and this is the legendary, iconic glove of Cobra. But there's lots of, like, neat things to find. Uh, there's still a bit more of a... There's still exploration in this, just not as much as Deception's Conquest mode. It's it's much more straightforward, but I kind of... But this is, like, a little too straightforward. I kind of wish they had gotten, like, a happy mix of both. Because you could just play the other conquest mode for hours and hours, and this is like a quick five hour thing. I'm still not doing a full LP because it's really repetitive. Kira's legendary knife! Kira- who is Kira? So that happens- for more hidden chests. I'm not sure if that happens because I squashed this bug. I think it might. Ch some chests are secret and like just show up if you do certain things. Yeah, that's Kira. Sure, Kira. I'm gonna make a bold prediction. Kira's never coming back in anything. Maybe as like a background character in a future story mode, but no one fucking wants Kira. Natara is at least a weirdo. She's a weird gross vampire with huge gross titties. I mean, they're not gross, but. Okay, I got the, the soundtrack tune from when we did the motor combat. If you wanna listen to that, there's such they really stretched it thin with unlockables for this game. There's so much stuff that's just like random production art and just music. Alright, I think this is a creator to creator bullshit. For your Elder God costume. It looks stupid as all shit. So here we could see, you know, it's, it's called theming, folks. Here we have Kira and Cobra, two members of the Black Dragon. Which is kind of fucked up, all things considered, because Kira wears red a lot, so you'd think she'd be more of a red dragon character. I think they're black dragon. They might be red dragon. I don't know. Who are you? Fucking I idiots. Know. No one crosses this bridge. No one. We shall see. Cobra, I just got the signal from Cabal. The ambush has begun. If you're not a member of the Black Dragon Clan... Okay, they are Black finish. Dragon. So then you go into, like, fighting mode for, like, major characters. So, unfortunately, I have to play PS2 Mortal Kombat-style games. And Dagon... I mean, Tavon fucking sucks. Like, I have no special moves. Never mind, I'm super wrong. Alright, so, Taven, we don't know much about him, BD. He has the Ring of Hatred. So that's cool. What's Godly Charge? That's Godly Charge. Here's the Ring of Hatred. Ring of Hatred. So all of his moves are just... I hit you with my fists or feet, and there's fire. Because he's just a generic fireman, I guess. Humiliated by his defeat, and realizing he's a jobber, that Kira and Akira abandon him, Kova shouted, Make no mistake, stranger! You will feel the bite of the Black Dragon soon enough! You didn't win! You didn't win! As he escapes into the jungle. Alright, I'm gonna step on these rats. I don't feel good about it, but... Okay. It's a good thing someone hid a bunch of coins in that tree trunk. So, the thing that I kind of am mixed up about... I'm sure people explain it in the comments, hopefully, if you can. I thought this took, like, you know, generations ago. Not that Cobra and... Uh, Kira... Yeah, that's her name. I, shouldn't they not be active? Should they not even be born yet? I thought this took place like thousands of years ago and you played it leading up to Armageddon. Or is this just a few weeks before Armageddon? Maybe it's just a few weeks and maybe I'm mixing a bit of it up with um, uh, Deception's Conquest mode because that happened generations before uh, the, the actual game timeline. So you can see, it doesn't look, it looks okay. 
And you have full 3D movement, which you kind of barely did, and, uh... What was that? So that was some type of uh, ketchup. Or mustard. I think it was ketchup. That's weird. That's fucked up. I don't like that. Collect some coins. And that's a nice, nice little checkpoint. Now, the, the, this, these are, of course, Chun-Li's uh, uh, mythological bracelets. No, it's Kai's wristband. Sure, Kai. Whoever you say. Oh, there's, there's shit over there. There's fucking more shit over here. There's a little music right here. You know, it's the Bow Ride Show's brewery tune. Amazing. What you got in here? 300 coins. Oh, we're going to lock so much shit in Armageddon mode. I mean, crypt mode. So that's... that's end game there that gaping thing is pulsating upwards and downwards plunging ever up and ever down i don't that thing makes me uncomfortable it has to be a marker from like the way is blocked oh no what would you do young tavanano oh david place your hand on the model i really don't want to no, it's just a recording of your father. So it's actually one of the shittier parts of the game. Uh, they kind of give you a new power or you learn something. But then you have to go through waves and waves of enemies and just like this boring arena until you're like, okay, you've Where you've learned it. So I might this cut some of this out. Area. Father, is that you? No, Taven. I am merely a reflection of your father. What does that mean? My purpose is to train you for your coming challenge. Would you tell me what this is all about? No! You will find your answers within the temple. This monolith was created to help you hone your fighting skills. Jeez, there are others like all this monolith brother. just for little old Taven. It can only be activated by you or your brother. Now then, let us begin your training. Okay, so... Here's your first obelisk train. You got it. Now, the cool thing about this game is you do have, like, regular combat against motherfuckers. Uh, so, against jobbers that aren't worth Taven's, like, uh, sort of time. You know, Cobra, he's really worth his time. But for this, you just kill a lot of enemies and they don't take that much. So it's a little, like, you know, uh, Shaolin Monks, but not really. So now we're fighting Jarek, I guess. Jarek, not a great design for him that they did. Like, I think his normal design from MK4, his default was fine. This one's just, I, I don't know. I don't even know what they're going for, really. Okay, you can throw fatalities out at randos, which is kind of cool, actually. Just give me a second. Finish him. I think, I think anything does a fatality, which is kind of strange. Finish him. All right, cool. Well, wait, what do you want? Yeah, neck snap. So, so each face button does a different fatality, and they're really quick. Like, they should be, though. You're doing very well. I really like the way that you killed those holograms. Or Were they holograms, or were they guys in costumes? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, that was boring. Was I inside the monolith? <laughs> How was that possible? Maybe How is that possible? Ah, oh, I should ask my dragon friend if it's possible. All right, this way should be cleared up for whatever. Yeah, okay, good. All right, these are the deadly traps. Deadly. This looks interesting. So this is the the ancient uh, ground pounding. Uh, dial on the floor. It kind of works like Banjo Kazooie powers. You do that, and a chest appears. Hmm. Thousand coins. So this is the legendary mirror of Natara. Oh, I don't know what that was. It did something. It was just a view that showed me ahead. So, the weird thing about this game in general is that, oh, you see these traps? Uh, well, they're, they're hard to miss. Uh, they, I think they kill you in one hit. Like, if you get hit just by, just by once. And so now, if you're getting squished by, like, a giant rock or, like, getting my dick smashed off, fine. But this looks like it'll hit me and maybe hurt a little bit. But no, it's like a one-hit kill. 
And like, I might get hit, I don't know. Might get hit. But everyone in the comments is like, I really hope he gets hit. But I might not, who knows. Cage's picture. Uh, from Johnny with love. Johnny, why did you use a horrible render of you from Deadly Alliance? It's not your best shot. So now you can see if you get in an arena like this, wonder what's gonna happen. Oh yeah, jobbers. I think these are just black dragon hula hula dudes. Alright, let's start this off right. Yeah, cool. Alright, so that to give you weapons, which is neat. It's a big Hammer Brothers hammer. Now you always want to grab these weapons because they kill everything and usually one hit. But you have like two strikes too, which is neat. Never mind, you have like four strikes. Or sorry, every face button's a different dumb hit. There's Cabal's legendary mask, yeah. That's his breathing apparatus. He's fucking dying without that, man. Oh shit, it's Cabal. You fight well. I don't know who you are, but there is always room in the Black Dragon Clan for, for people that kill theory. half my guys. I have no intention of joining you and your thugs. You will regret your decision. Fight. All right, go fight Cabalo. Cabela? Yeah. Whoa, that move's not bad. It's just an auto combo. All right, so fortunately, you're not allowed to fatality characters during these matches. Strange looking warrior. At least I won't have to deal with his clan any longer. Why do you have a mask? Why do you leave multiple masks just to... hanging out here, Cabal? I don't know. I didn't know he had one here in Earthrealm. I'm sure he'll explain everything once I locate him in the main chamber. Us, uh, this place looks cool. Maybe. I don't know. What you got? Alright, 500 coins. Uh, I'm sure, surely we'll unlock some really hype, uh, uh, production art in the crypt. So there's one Kung Lao's alternate costumes. I, a lot of people didn't really seem to like this one at the time, but I thought it was cool. I mean, it, it made me feel mo he was more of a Shaolin monk than his normal costume. You know, they just give out those razor hats on graduation. Oh, there's a trinket over there. That looks like mother having one of her visions. <laughs> looks like she's having a headache. And this must be father speaking with the elder gods. These sleeping figures might be my brother and I. How long was I? There's lots of bugs, dude. Are you not What's concerned this? about this? It appears as if my brother and I are attacking some demon. I have no memory of that. <laughs> was I high? What does mean? Where is everyone? It doesn't seem like anyone's worshipped here in ages. <laughs> Blood Hunter. Do these guys work for Scarlet? All right, is that enough for the skull meter? I do like that skull meter. I'm a fan. You can just juggle guys a lot, actually, in this. I kind of forgot. It's like, please stop! You've killed them. Warriors seem to know who I am. Was this keys? Dari Dairo's keys. I. F who's Dairo? Right. All right. That's. <sighs> It's a wristwatch. Um, Sonya's military watch? Fuck you! What? Okay, unlocked meat somehow! Reptile. I hope. No, wait, that could be... That could be like Quan Chi, it kind of... I don't know, probably, I have no, I have no, I have no clue what that was. Like, he kind of tapped it, he didn't even put his hand Time in it. has come for you and Dagon to prove your worth to Adenia. But don't you love us already? As protector of the realm. I give you each a weapon of great power. You will find them on the wall behind this altar. Your mother has also left you items of great importance. You Couldn't you just put it in a trunk next to my bed? Where are they? What is their purpose? You must find Blaze, a fire spot. Oh, it's Sector. 
Use the items we have given you to defeat him. The victor will not only succeed me as protector of Adenia, but he will receive a gift worthy of a god. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. Oh, who saw it coming? Sector to warship. Rendezvous for immediate evac. Who's a Sector person? Who's a Cyrax person? Holy shit, what a... I'm such a fucking moron. Taven. Immediately get captured by, like, some sparks in my back. What? The, what are they doing to my ass? Grandmaster Sector, the prisoner is awake. Good. Now I can get the information I need. Ugh. What are wub, you? Wub, 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 I will wub. ask the questions. I need to know what you learned from the altar in the temple. What message did you receive? Wub, Answer me. Wub, wub, wub. You are going to regret having toyed Increase with power. Sword. Increase the power of the ass blaster. What information did you acquire from the altar? It's not quite Metal Gear Solid, is this scene? The ship is being attacked. Incoming fighters. Special forces. Oh shit. Man, that, that has the same wooden, shitty acting as Ronda Rousey. That's incredible. Was she actually in this beforehand? Okay. Let me out. I need to escape, please. Yay! So this, this level is kind of cool, actually. You have a time limit, and it's and it's it's not at all lenient. Uh, you actually have to blitz through this. You know, this would be a great section for like AG, AGDQ. This has got goo in it. All right, now it starts. It has, it's half an hour, right? It says half an hour. It's not fucking half an hour. It's way worse than that. It's actually like two minutes or some shit. We have damaged your reactor. Oh, no, I don't care about that. Oh, wait, no, I need to find a key. I like when I pat some bodies down. It's amazing. I love this game. No, no, no time for that. Oh, jeez. I keep rubbing their dicks and assholes, but nothing's happening. Kika, what's this? Access granted. See, it's actually kind of exciting. Is that enough? Oh, yeah, yeah, now I actually have 30 seconds. It's fine, I think I did it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did okay. Oh shit, I gotta fight Sector, he's got double beep katanas! I have to find some way out of this ship and back to the portal. He's right behind you. I'm not leaving until I get all the information I need, even if I have to beat it out of you. Fight! It's not very robot-like. So this 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 game has the weird danger zones, you know the ones. You know I don't want to talk about it. Oh oh no, he might get me into the danger zone. No no danger zone. <laughs> I think that's what they're called. Ah oh, fuck. Yeah danger zone. A danger zone. Please get into danger zone. Yeah. He didn't really take damage. Whoa, everything's exploding. Okay. That's a pretty cool effect because. <laughs> Finally, I found a way out of the warship. I have to get back to the portal and return to the cave. Maybe Orin has some idea who these strange warriors are. I can't help but wonder if my brother Dagon has encountered the same foes I have. That's amazing. Welcome back to you. Oh, that was nuts. I was ambushed more than once. By your father's holy men? Well, no, considering you have that dumbass tattoo on your head, who would not want to ambush you? This is not right. Something is amiss. Did you learn more about the quest? Where is the weapon your father left you? I, I don't know. There was no weapon. I'm assuming it was stolen long ago. As for the quest, apparently it's a race to combat a fire spawn named Blaze. Whoever defeats him will succeed father as protector of Adenia. Yes, Blaze. And Orin's like, man, that's whack. You, but how can defeating him in battle grant you the title of protector? Your mother was mortal. You are only a half god. 
Transforming you into a full god would require... Isn't being a half-god fine? What? Can we not be, you know, satisfied with that? I must travel to the north. Mother has left me an item in her temple. I hope it's still there. Oh god, the Ling Kuei. So I don't know, this is like, this isn't like... This isn't high art or anything, but it's stupid good fun, I guess. I wish they would make some type of mode like this in the future. Like, why not make Mortal Kombat God of War style? Alright, so now we're in the frozen waste norths. I think this place is actually called Arctica. Like, that's where, like, Sub-Zero set up shop. Baraka's blade. That's torn out of his arm, I hope. So I'm gonna just shoot a fireball right at these assholes. It's gonna work. Watch. Okay. It didn't, it didn't super work, but it didn't not work. Ow. Oh. Oh, wait. You can uppercut guys onto these. You gotta do it. Gotta do it. It worked! You, you all thought it didn't work, but it did. Yeah! Double penetration! Alright, what you got? What you got? Oh yeah, it's the Wampa! Yeah, that's a Wampa. What a goof. Oh, I wish you would say like like Mortal Kombat round one fight. Yeah. It's just like Ice Beast. That couldn't be more generic. At least give him like a weird name. Like the Yeti! And you'd think he'd be really weak against fire. Like he's taking some damage, but. Yeah, just the uppercut combos. Oh! Oh, uh, why can't I fatality that guy? He's not important. I really want to fight this thing again. I just fought it. And the, there's not a lot of sp like room here, so... Well, let's get psyched up, getting hyped up! Oh, oh, oh. That's random. Sonia, you should probably be wearing something a bit You've got some explaining more warm. What are the Takunin up to? Why do you assume God, this this Sonya design is awful. I love their design in MK4. I think that was good. You teleported away from the Takunin warship. First to the heart of the mountain, then to this frozen wilderness. I can follow you anywhere. Okay. Answer me. What is Sector planning? I appreciate your assistance with the beast, but I am afraid I cannot help you. I know nothing about Sector. You're hiding something. Comply or I'll be forced to bring you in for I, I don't like how the special forces, basically Jax and Sonya, they always like come in in these story modes and they're just like, what do you know? And they're like, I, I don't really know anything. Well, come back! Alright. Let's do this. And like, in this game, because there's so many characters, they can only mocap so many fighting styles. They took the two hand-to-hand -hand fighting styles and the weapon style uh, from Deception. And they're like, holy shit, we have so many more characters to do in MK Armageddon, so let's just separate the styles. And uh, let's just spread it out throughout the entire cast. And so now you just have one weapon style and one like... Uh, so it's basically like MK4. Which is basically when you think about it, the first time style switching was really done. I mean, it wasn't very good, but... Everyone just had their big dumb weapon. Like Fujin had a crossbow. Man, Fujin should have came come back as a playable character. Like I thought he was going to come back as DLC. Wait, did he? An MKX? I don't think so. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. Wait, was Fujin his DLC? Sonya Blade backed away, aware of Taven's strength. Be on your guard, stranger. I'll be watching you. You didn't win. You didn't win. Ah, oh, shit. You must have been sent by the gods. Not really. Manner of speaking. Well, actually, yes. <laughs> Our abbot has been captured by the Tengu. You must free him. 
I am not here to As Sekiro, you. what's happening? I'm looking for a temple. Do you know of one? A herald of the gods who searches for a temple. Only the abbot would know of such a place. He could reveal to you its location. I'm pretty sure when you talk to the abbot, yeah, he's like, it's around the corner. These monks are just being unhelpful asses. Where can I find this abbot? He's being held in the Tengu encampment. That way, to the north. Thank I am in the north. I appreciate your help. Now excuse me. So, I one neat thing about this is that it's not really like a Taven thing, but he does get annoyed the more side quests pile up when people are like, hey, can you help us? And he's just like, oh, it's so annoying. Well, I should just do this because they gave me shit. I can't seem to activate this obelisk. I'll come back to it later. Nice. I defeated the evil monks. I can't, I can't activate this obelisk. Oh, there's ground pounder. CH pounder! I'm good for health. Wait, no, I'm not good for stamina. I think that's stamina. Oh shit, an evil beast. I am grateful that the gods would send a hero to free me. I did not come. I'm not a hero. Turns out I'm not a hero, actually. You must be referring to the temple of Delia. Yeah, that's my mama. Monks, and I will reveal its location to you. By the elder gods. Very well. Lead the way. Like, he's already annoyed. Like, I have to help these religious nutbags. You know the game is cheap, though, and it just has this little ledge to let you know this is the playable area? Like, there's something about that makes you go, oh, that's cheap. Like, I, I know why it's there. It's to just corral people and make, like, the collision, like, easy to navigate and stuff. So I get it, but at the same time, I'm like, fuck. We are here at last, our place of worship. Oh, but someone has beaten up all our monks. Again, Do you know who did it? I think it was, uh, uh, Draman. The gods are great. Now, if you will please direct me to the temple. Please. Indeed. The temple of Delia, the Lady of Flame. Built to honor the Adenian sorceress who foresaw the great battle. Legends tell that... The please, I am in a hurry. Ah. <sighs> The temple is down Fine, I won't regale you with my story. It was a good one. I was going to do all the voices. I see the obelisk begins to glow with the power of my fellow monk's prayers. No. I only pray the Tengu do not defile it with their touch. I don't care. So I'm just gonna warp inside and you're just gonna blow your minds. Let me blow your mind. So, Dagon looks okay. He, he looks like a bit more of a character than Taven. David, Taven Taven's very mi much like white meat baby face. I have empowered it to train you further in the God, her design so shit and lazy. You are not really my mother, are you? No, I am not your mother. <laughs> you are a reflection of the woman who enchanted this. What is reflection? This is to aid you on your quest. So there is another big training sequence. Only so. find a gift in the temple. All right, there you go. Yeah, I'm basically a demon. Be afraid of me. Can I talk to that abbot? Yeah, I talked to him there. He knows not to mess with me. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, you're really devoted. Who are these guys? Stop where you are. Your dark allies may have escaped for now, but you have you mean no Jax? Kill him. <laughs> I cannot be oh, Wu Li. Wu Lai. Oh, shit. Sorry, sir. Let me get Johnny Cage's iconic glasses. Wait, they're not even Johnny's or Darius's. Ooh, look at that. That evasive roll. You know, defense is the first thing I think of when I think of this game. Yeah. Yeah, you don't really get a chance to do the fatalities too often. Stop! You are free to go. <laughs> oh, I'm free to go? After I've already defeated your entire clan? How generous of you. Oh! My sincerest apologies, warrior. When I was told that you had attacked my men near the obelisk, I assumed you were with the other two outsiders we encountered. But clearly you are human. You must be Lin Kuei. Yeah, I that's me. Idea what you're Master of the Lin Kuei. What is a Lin Kuei? The Lin Kuei are a rival clan of powerful warriors. You fight with such skill, I mistook you for one of their ranks. We Tengu have an uneasy truce with the Lin Kuei, 
and we oh, their but you attack them anyway. They reside in an ancient temple near here. And where would this temple be? Further up this path, it is not far. But you would be wise not to venture near it. The Lin Kuei are secretive. And sensitive. And hospitable to strangers as we are. I will be ready. They're just as racist as we are. You are free to go. I like that too. Finish him! <laughs> Alright. So, we find Sub-Zero. Are you gonna sniff Sub-Zero in this? Oh shit, never mind. What? So it is true. What? Delia's son has returned to claim the prize and save the realms. I figured you would have Find come all the male voices in these PS2 you seem to know Mortal Kombat games are all the same. They're all like, you. "Oh, hello. I am no friend of yours. I am Rain, a prince of Edenia. Once I have defeated you, I will find and kill your brother as well. Then I will claim the prize." Well, prince, let us see what you can do. All right, we're going to defeat Purple Rain here. Nice. But like, no, hold on, like, no, hold on. This is my big combo, look at it. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> it didn't really work that time, okay? You see, you see, Rain is all water-based to see. So he just came out of that water goo. Oh, I know, I, I gotta time that better. Oh, shit! Storm Sword! There you go, that's my big combo. 33% damage, 5 hits, I think that's good. Rain's body vanished into a watery portal. This fight is not over, Taven, his voice echoed. The prize will be mine, and I will have my revenge. Ha 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 ha. Oh my god. It's a fucking war out here. Jesus. Let me in. Why do you guys hate me so much? The Tengu leader was right. My mother's temple is here, but it's now occupied by a clan of ninjas known as the Lin Kuei. Locating the item she left me will not be easy. So they're basically squatting. Way inside. Oh man, here we go. Alright, just make sure not to like, piss all over the floors of Sub-Zero's house now. Or he'll freeze it? I don't know what I'm going for there. Well, they got these cool little slides. If that not is for the Lin Kuei, who is it for? Little slidey holes. Get out of here. You think these guys would be like know how to handle being frozen? If they they keep like a sack of warm pee on them or something to like burst them out of it. What? Oh! Something happened. Hey, Sub, are we gonna do anything about that blocked ice wall that's like separating us from getting to the bathroom? He's like, no. Lin Kuei do not need bathrooms. All right. Look at this, this is great. Yeah. Oh, I was rewarded for that. What is it? It's 500 coins for some reason, okay. What are we looking at here? All right, I think Frost or somebody jumps out. Or I break her out of that. <laughs> she was put on a timeout. You are alive. What? Uh, what happened? You I'm just gonna attack up. you. Cause that's how it works in stuff like this. Frost. Where? Sub-Zero? Uh, no. Sub-Zero? The medallion. Give me the medallion! I'm clearly not Sub-Zero. delirious. Maybe you should- The Lin Kuei will be mine! Ugh, alright. So many fights are like, who are you? Combat time! Whoa, please stop! 
Yeah. Exciting fight. Yeah, the battle of nothing. David's final blow knocked Frost from her delirium. You are not the one I seek, she muttered. And it kind of embarrassingly leaves. Yeah, I got something stupid. Okay, Frost is alternate costume. It's fine, I guess. And Frost's mask, which she was wearing. Congratulations, I'm rich. I have 20,000 coins. That's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. This render. Like, show this to anybody and it's just gonna befuddle them. Like, I like his little, like, unsure lurch. Where am I going? An empty room. Maybe there were lots. Think again, intruder. You may have bested my Lin Kuei warriors, but you will not get past me. <sighs> and you are? I am Sub Zero, Zero. Grand Master of the Lin Kuei. And you are trespassing. Fight! This is my mama's house. Man, remember Sub Zero's like Deadly Alliance costume so bad? He's like just kind of old. Why did they do that? He, they just made him old for one, one game, and then they just kind of ran it back. Wow! Holy shit, Sub Zero! Damn. Like, can anyone explain that? They just like they just dropped it after that game, and they never showed him again. And even, like, when he didn't have that costume, like, this costume that he's wearing now, and his default in Deception, like, it's just like he wasn't old anymore. He's just this icy man. That's it. It's just really strange. I don't know what they're going for, because it's not like Deadly Alliance happened, like, 25 years later, like MKX did. It's just, like, I don't know. What was Netherrealm smoking? Yeah, beat him. Alright, Sub Zero Grandmaster, who I, I have easily destroyed. Your tattoo. Oh. What about it? Yeah, Your well, shut up, okay? It was a college me. mistake! Who are you? And why are you here? This must be it. This must be what? This temple was a shrine to my mother before your clan commandeered it. I assure you, it had been abandoned long before we arrived. I it really wasn't me. My name is Taven. I merely came here to retrieve something. A gift from my mother. Then tell me, where is this gift? I don't know, dude. I just got here. Door. The door on the right was unlocked when we first arrived here years ago. There was nothing inside. The other door has remained sealed, despite our best efforts to open it. Wh it which my door? Has already been here to retrieve his gift. Strange. That would mean he's been awake for quite some time. I assume. Makes no sense. Key. You could say that. My, like, clearly Sub-Zero, it has a giant handprint on it. Uh, it's dumb armor. Yeah, he looks real cool. Now tell me, it looks like a, like a fucking NPC in Elder Scrolls. A powerful set of armor. Apparently, I need it for my quest. Something important is supposed to happen once I complete it, though I do not know what that something is yet. At first, I assumed the quest was nothing more than a game. No you know, like the game. What do you mean? A warrior named Rain mentioned something about saving the realms. And I've also- Rain, that punk-ass bitch! Red. I don't recognize their crest, though it seems vaguely familiar. A dragon, I believe. Do you have any idea who they are? Oh, it's the black I dragon. Agree. I don't want to talk about them. Okay. It's all that coins. Grandmaster! More intruders have breached the temple! The east entrance! Friends of yours? They are dark warriors, yet they resemble our own Lin Kuei. Oh shit! It's a bunch of noobs! Just give me the Ice Scepter so I can do that shit too. Time to choose sides, friend or foe. Uh, I'll help. Then defend the Lin Kuei Temple. Smash these new intruders. <laughs> smash these new intruders. I'll leave you to it. You just gotta smash them and bash them. Smash! What a silly cutscene. Let me get all this. I'm gonna get paid. Now that's that that was like an arrow pointing to this, but. 
Sub Zero alternate costume. Man, that one's cool. I like that Shredder one. Maybe I shoot a fireball. Yeah! I got Sub Zero's weird amulet. That was some fucking Magic MacGuffin that made Sub Zero like super strong, like stronger than he should be. Katana's fan. Collecting all the bullshit. It's not going well. Oh shit! Yeah, it's really not going well. Alright, it's just last Shadow Stalker. Yeah. Who's giving me these? I guess my parents. They're proud. I just. That was a cool costume for Noob Sabat. It was neat. Alright, get me out of here. Is that the door? It looks like this is the door. Let me leave. Let me leave. I'm done with this Lin Kuei Temple. Oh, that royalty free pot smashing sound effect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's leave. Oh, it's going to be a big combat arena, isn't it? At least let me fight Noob. Ooh. Oh, smoke. I don't know. I kind of like this version of smoke. It's different. Oh, shit, he's got an Ice Scepter, though. I need that Ice Scepter bad. Hopefully I can get it. I'm not sure if I will, but... Yeah, yeah, this is Ice Scepter. Let me give it. Oh, you fuckers. All right, this is gonna take a while, though. Let me give you the ice scepter that you're gonna be smashing and bashing for a while. Oh wait, it's, did I? Did it's destroyed? Damn it! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Just die, just die. You're the last one. No, Shadow Assassin. Can't step to me. I got my stupid ice scepter. All right. Ah, oh, I disappeared. Come on. You will not escape. Okay. Like he's just like a misty body. It's sexy. I like it. Look, he's a little puff the magic dragon over there. Round one. Fight. Oh, that's a bad start to this match. Alright, Smoke. You've had your last puff. Oh. Wasn't as cool if I just, like, hit him in the shin. Defeated, Smoke teleported away. He may have lost, but Smoke's master would know of this interloper who had ruined their plans against the Lin Kuei. Oh, what? What were those? <laughs> or you will die. There's Noob. We shall see. Round one. I love how they gave new monkey style. It fits him. Ooh, that was a close one. Yes. What? What? I should thank you. You probably you should. Life. I I did. Who is he? He doesn't seem human. He is Noob Saibot, a warrior from the Nether Realm. He is my brother. Your brother. Why did he try to kill you? I think they revealed that in Dead in Deception, I think. It was probably one of the only few like revelations of Mortal Kombat games where I was like, whoa, that's cool. They are called the Red Dragon, a clan of mysterious warriors. Every clan's a clan of mysterious motherfuckers. Where? Shard Mountain. That sounds fun. It's so let's go to Charred Mountain. Has chosen a path of darkness. I wish I could help him remove the corruption that fills Noob Saibot's soul. Yeah, but in now other instances, you're like, I don't want to help. Dragon stronghold. I must return to Orin. Of course you do. Me there. 
Maybe then I will find some answers as to why I am being pursued. Hey, you're back. Uh, how's the quest going? Are you ready to begin your search for Blaze? Not yet. The warriors in red ambushed me again outside the temple. I met someone there named Sub-Zero. He gave me information that could lead me to them. Who are they? He said they're the uh -huh. Red Dragon Clan. His Lin Kuei recently located their stronghold. It's in Charred Mountain. Hey, that's where I need to send you. Before I search for the fire spawn. They may be the I don't know where the fire spawn sword. could be, but I'm going to Will Charred Mountain to do something else. Charred Mountain. Like, that's a pretty decent place to search a fucking search, idiot. Stop. Oh, there he is. Fujin. I sense that oh, I know no you. To your actions here, then, as a parent. I suggest you return to Edenia immediately. I would like some information first. The Red Dragon have attacked me twice. I'd like to know the reason, and I'm not leaving until I find it. Why? Stop. Just do your quest, idiot. I will stop you. By force, if necessary. I respect you, Fujin. You are a friend to my family. But I will not leave. Then you leave me no choice. Man, there's a lot of starch in Fujin's ponytail. Did Fujin just come back for this game? I think he did after MK4. He wasn't in Deception. And he was like seen in the story mode of MKX. But it's like, I wish they'd like make him a little bit different from Raiden, because he's like very similar, like his hair and his eyes and stuff, so. Like, and, and there's a lot of characters that already use wind for shit. Like, Katana does. Sindel kind of does. Like, even rain in some instances is just a different color. Yeah, come on, come on. Come on, come on. I've killed the god. Which is always impressive. <laughs> Look at his ponytail freak the fuck out. It's like a snake. But I need to confront the red dragon. You really don't. The entrance to their stronghold. I hope they haven't been alerted to my presence. I'll soon find out. All right. Do you think it's Liu Kang's? No. Kung Lao's. That's not Jax's. Nitara's belt. Tanya's Joker. Uh, so I think that's a good peek at uh, Conquest Mode for Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Ah, it's, it's good, cheesy, dumb fun. It's not exactly the most complex thing in the world, but it gets to the heart of dumb Mortal Kombat lore that we all cherish.